Hello there Pisces, this is Lex. I'm here to do your general reading because water signs have the most views on the what do you need to know. So if you have not checked that out, please do so. Thank you so much water signs, okay? Please subscribe and hit the notification bell so that you're notified when I post new content. Join us every Friday evening for Tarot After Dark, 10 p.m. Eastern. There we're going to do a live reading, discussion, and a live adult game related to romance, intimacy, relationships, and you know, it is adults only, so please be mindful, okay? Um, if you'd like to reach me directly, there's a link in the description to my website, victoryforhope.com. So I have already pre-shuffled and drawn your cards. I will go through in the order in which they came out, and then I'll rearrange and clarify as necessary. All right, so we have the world, ego, four of water, Ace of Water, King of Air, and the Wheel. Crowning the overall energy of your reading, I have Reconsider, and that is clarified by the Eight of Earth. Okay. All right, Pisces. What I see here doesn't look too bad. It doesn't look too bad. I know there's a couple of cards that kind of made you that may be um that may have taken you aback but it's not that bad and it can be fixed if you address the issues now okay with this ego and this four of water here this is the reconsider okay the overall energy of it is based on the energy from these two cards specifically because I don't feel Pisces that you are seeing the whole big picture of things. I feel that you are one track and you want things to be just your way right now, this way, and it has to be done in a particular manner, but you're not um, taking into account all of the possibilities and opportunities that are in front of you. There is more than one way to reach your goal. And I feel that the way that you're doing it is not going to yield the results that you're hoping for. OK, you're going to miss a great opportunity if you continue doing things the way that you're doing them. Do not be so prideful that you cannot ask for help. Do not be so prideful to admit, OK, I might have effed up here. You need to step back and regroup, work on your game plan, reconsider, work on it. OK. All right. You may need to uh, with the also with the eight of um, earth here on the card, it says learning all there is to know about a topic as knowledgeable as you may be Pisces about a specific area. You don't know every damn thing. All right. It is OK to ask for help and to consult outside um, people. OK, that have may have. Be done this longer than you or they just may know something different that you didn't know exists because that does happen okay once you have done that and you take a more impartial diplomatic and professional approach to this situation whatever it is okay this is general could be love could be something else apply this information how it fits to your life if it does but if it don't don't try to force it all right after you have Balance things out and instead of being in this this devil stage because ego is the same as the devil in the uh, traditional tarot. Once you have balanced your mental and your emotions out. OK, once you are more open minded about it, that's when you are going to see the results of things changing. In your favor, in your fortune, this is the wheel of fortune, positive changes. Things are suddenly going to start moving for you. Path towards enlightenment, okay? The world, you may actually, for some of you, be able to see the world once you make the changes you need and then have that new beginning, okay? Ace of water here. Some of you, uh, this could be your energy, Pisces, or you could be dealing with another uh, water sign, uh, Pisces, Cancer, or Scorpio. OK, some of you may be moving into a new home and perhaps 
the house you got your eye on isn't the one. There's something out there better for you, okay? But we're going to clarify this. We're going to get you together, Pisces. We're going to get you together. I have the Eight of Pentacles again. Have the Eight of Pentacles again. Work on it. You don't know everything. Walk away from what's not working. It may, and this may be something that has worked before. Whatever you're doing, the way that you're going about it may have worked before, but it ain't working now. As times change, as people change, you have to adapt, adjust, and follow suit. If the way you're doing things is not moving, okay? Knight of Pentacles, not moving, okay? It's steady. It's solid, but there's no growth. There's no progression. All right. All right. Let's go over to your romance oracles. I spent a little bit more time on that than I wanted to. So we're going to try to get through this. I kind of try to keep these things under 10 minutes. For your love oracles. Mm. Cancer just got one of these cards I'll, I'll, I'll explain in a minute okay i have made the effort great love is worth taking the steps you got it to take cancer's got this one i have codependency addictions are affecting your romantic life and i have deception someone is wearing a false mask in this relationship cancer's also got this one cancer's got both of these so a lot of you may be dealing with the cancerian okay but we're going to clarify this some of you could be codependent or too dependent upon one another. You may lean too much on your partner. Some of you can be overindulging in alcohol or substances or, you know, other addictions. Because when I say addictions that, you know, people automatically think of drugs and alcohol. That is not always the case. You could be addicted to work. You could be addicted to social media. You could be addicted to um, gambling. You could be addicted to porn. There's all kinds of addictions out there, but you are overindulging. And either you're overindulging in something or you're overly dependent on your partner and you are trying to save face. Okay. Let's clarify this for you, Pisces. If you or your partner is not working, and the other one is who the, the non-worker needs to get off their ass because the worker's getting tired of taking care of everything. I have the Queen of Pentacles, the Ace of Swords, and the Eight of Wands. Okay. I feel that this new plan, this new idea, okay, you're gonna be moving once again. King of Air with this Ace of Air. Once you change your ways. And change your thought process. Things going to move real quick. Real swiftly. Okay. And it's going to bring back that stability. That you were once used to. Because see we don't went from a knight to a queen now. All right. Whew, Pisces. All right darlings. I'm going to pull an archangel oracle. To tie all of this in. And I am, I have clairvoyance. Okay. I am helping your spiritual sight to awaken fully so you can clearly see heavenly love. Look beyond your own ego. Look beyond what you've been doing before that ain't working no more. Look beyond all the signs are right in front of you. You're refusing to see them, Pisces, okay? All right, that is your reading, Pisces. If this does resonate or fit your situation, please give me a comment or a thumbs up. Share with the fellow Piscean who can use this message, okay? Because it's a lot of y'all out there. Thank you so much, all water signs, for having the most views. If you haven't checked your last, what do you need to know? They're posted. Watch that one because the new one will be posted in a few days. Join me every Friday, 10 p.m. Eastern for Tarot After Dark. And if you would like to reach me directly, there's a link in the description to my website, victoryforhope.com. Take care.